some breaking news for you this morning. Our Caroline Peters is on the scene of a house fire where she's been all morning tracking what has been going on. Um, uh, Caroline, what, you, what can you tell us about uh, how early this fire broke out? Yeah, Renee, the fire broke out at 2 a.m. this morning. So the two adults that lived here, their smoke detectors went off. And because of that, they were able to call the fire department and the Colorado Springs the fire department got here in a timely manner. Uh, they had to call extra men to the scene. So 40 of them responded to the scene fast. We don't know what caused it yet. They're still investigating. Uh, they're pulling these cars out now to see what caused the fire. But most of the damage, as you can see, is in the garage. The roof of the garage has also collapse and there's smoke damage throughout of the house. So it's, you know, and, and like I said, our investigators, they're, they're going to start talking to the homeowners. They and really what they try and do is recreate, you know, everything starting from last night, uh, whether when they got home or when they went to bed. Um, but, you know, in this case here, obviously smoke alarms save lives and that's how we're able to talk to them and get the get the full story. Now things have calmed down a lot. We'll continue to monitor you guys and keep you posted throughout this morning. Uh, it looks like all the hot spots have calmed down, which is why they're able to actually get into the garage and sort of investigate as to what's going on. But stick with us for updates throughout the morning. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs. Caroline Peters, News 5.